Today we're going to look at how to use verbs in a simple present form. Okay, uh, you use verbs in a simple present form when you want to show a repeated action, an action that is usual or something that is happening uh, now. Okay, the verb we're going to look at today is speak. Okay, speak. Here I have some examples. I speak English. He, she, it speaks English. And you see I added an S because this is third person singular. So we had S or ES. Okay, we have we speak English, you speak English, and they speak English. Okay, I'm going to continue. I'm going to show you some uh, further examples or some more examples. Okay, we're back. Uh, we're going over the simple present tense form of verbs. Okay, now I have some basic rules that maybe you can try to remember. I think it will help you if you do remember. Okay, use the simple present to show an action. Uh, action is repeated, usual, or happening now. Okay, we have to see the first sentence. I play tennis. I play tennis. Okay, this is something that's repeated or usual. Cats like milk. Again, I would say this is repeated, uh, usual. California is in America. Okay, this is something that is definitely repeated, usual, and it's happening now. You are to, if you go and fly to America right now, California is in America. Okay, let's look at Amir Reads Books. Okay, let me direct you here. We have, uh, I have written down another uh, set of directions to help you with the uh, simple present tense. Speakers use simple present to talk about events in the near future. Okay, one example sentence that I have, the train leaves tonight. Okay, the class starts at eight o'clock. Okay, so these are examples, uh, usually with speakers, and it's used for a simple present to talk about events in the near future. It's talking about the future, but it's still simple present. Okay, so I hope this film uh, was of some help to you. Okay, thank you and have a nice day.